Good lads and lasses, so make sure you are back with another video and today's video, as you can tell, is well, the first part of I'm going to start and do daily vlogs. And when I'm at college and when I am doing work and stuff like that, I'm going to try and still vlog, but obviously I'm not going to rush into college and just whack a camera in college because that would be weird. Um, and you guys are probably not want to know what I'm learning because it's just... It's good, but maybe some of you guys will not feel interested in that. But I was going to start this tomorrow. This video will actually go up tomorrow. And um, today is Sunday. It will go out Monday. Monday is vlog will go out Tuesday. Tuesday's vlog will go out Wednesday, and vice versa as you go down the week. But today is Sunday, also known as Mother's Sunday or Mother's Day. Only in the UK, like it's a stupid sort of thing for mothers, and basically makes kids. Um, buy really 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 expensive presents and cards for their mothers so yeah that is what today is if you're not from the UK if you are well how are you spending Mother's Day and as I just looked outside my window look at that tree oh it's blossomed it is lovely but today um, as I've said about nine times it is Mother's Day the old firm Rangers vs Celtic has already been on and for my Argentinian viewers um, it's basically the Bocca Juniors and River Plate Derby, but from Glasgow, which is Scotland. Um, so yeah, it's basically that, uh, just about the same. But I wouldn't say people go to Lent to actually kill each other there. But yeah, that is what it is. And the final result was 2-1 to Celtic. As a Rangers supporter, I was crushed by this. Um, obviously, Ryan Kent scoring. And Morales um, had got sent off. He is Colombian striker. He got sent off. And... It uh, turns out Andy Halliday, a left back for Rangers, also got sent off after the final whistle, so I don't know how that works. But today for Mother's Day, I think I'm going along to the boozer, also known as the pub, um, for Mother's Day with my mum. But she's not here yet. I've been left. I'm going back in my living room because I like the living room and this is where I vlog. <laughs> so yeah, boom. Has she opened my card without me being here? She has as well. It's just even. She opened a card without me being here. But um, I have a guinea pig, if most of you don't know. So I'm really rocking this jacket. NCS t-shirt thing. Um, I'm going to do a video on that actually because I basically post social action day on NCS, which is basically an event where we like to give stuff to charity. Um, as I put the light on because I looked really dark there, as I go into the garage, I will go outside and explain more because this is a nice day in Newcastle. Sun's not shining, but there's hardly any clouds. So yeah, Social Action Day is basically um, where we like to do stuff for charity in our event from the, I, I do the Newcastle Foundation, um, Newcastle United Foundation thing. Um, so our little social action project is there is 10 of us and we are all doing a marathon so that is like 2.6 miles on a treadmill each and um, so which will add up to a marathon and we're all getting sponsored for that so if you would like to sponsor me um, please put in the comments below how much you would like to sponsor and um, your name next to it obviously so then I can um, meet you and obviously get sponsored from you because it's a great charity and our charity is called us is a mental health charity which a lot of us in the group um have had a lot of problems with mental health not just us ourselves but maybe family members friends or people they know um throughout our life so far have had mental health uh, problems so we like to support charities that do stuff like that so yeah that is our charity which we are going to be doing it for so if you would like to give something to a good cause um, please comment down below your name and how much you would like to donate. Hey, hello, Coco. That is Coco. Excuse me for like the feces that was there. Um, she has just done them. As I've cleaned her out. I think my mum's now back now. I think I'm in the back on. So yeah. Great. So I was like really scared by that. I'm lost. I don't know what to do, guys. What do people do in a daily vlog? What happens? <laughs> people have interesting lives, bar me. So yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go and lock my garage door now. So fridge. Food Oreos. <laughs> um biscuits. Um 
This is so nice. Just saying. That's so nice. I've got a Reese's one back here, but I'm not too keen on that one. Ah! I really hurt my fingers. So, like, yeah. There's jelly. Oh, wine. Mine. Not really. Don't worry. I'll drink wine. Um, this is where the crisps are used, okay? Not that I'm doing a house tour, in case anyone is wanting to come around mine. But, yeah, that is crisp. Ow, I keep slamming everything. <laughs> Uh, mac and cheese. If I wasn't going out for my lunch, I would probably have mac and cheese. But guys, home is where the heart is, and there's no place like home. And welcome to our happy home. In the end, I settled for a wacko. This is not an ad, just saying, I settled for a wacko. Can I just say, people who haven't watched the Cheddar Trade Cup final, I've missed a hell of a game. Sunland versus Portsmouth. Um, it was 1 0 to Sunland half time. Come the 90 minutes, it was 1 1. It was 2-1 one, one to Portsmouth with five minutes to go. Somehow Sunderland scored. And this is unbelievable. It has now gone to penalties. Portsmouth have scored their second penalty. Sunderland missed theirs. The keeper saved it. Two minutes for guys where I just adjust my hand. This is intense, guys. What a penalty shit of it is, though. Portsmouth keep us looking along like this. He's trying to get into the head of the Sunderland player. I'm a Newcastle supporter, so... I don't really want Sunderland to win this. So come on, Portsmouth. Come on, keeper. Sunderland scored that penalty, though. He's wanting an angle like that. If Portsmouth score this penalty, I think they've won. Out of five penalties, Sunderland have scored four, Portsmouth have scored four. If he scores this, it's 5 4 to Portsmouth. It's in. Portsmouth have won the Checker Trade Cup final. Oh my days, what a cup final this has been. And my friend is a Sunderland supporter. He just texted me there. <laughs> that is Portsmouth have won it. Congratulations to Portsmouth. The scenes there are incredible. I wish I could show you, but I would just get copyrighted. That is so good. Well done, Portsmouth. Uh, ah, so, guys, it is the morning after. I pause Gavin and Stacey because it is a great show. But today is obviously Sunday. It's not even Sunday. Yesterday was Sunday, which ended that vlog. Today is Monday. Um, but last night, I didn't get back till later on, and I had to basically not to the end of the vlog so this is the end of the vlog and this video is out now as you're watching and I'm currently editing uh, this one but recording uh, tomorrow's vlog which is today's vlog it's very confusing for me but it will be coming out Tuesday and Tuesday's vlog will be coming out Wednesday and as we go down the line you'll start to understand. But I would like to thank you very much for watching. If you have enjoyed the first day of the daily vlog make sure you smash the like button, subscribe if you're new, hit that bell button because you'll be notified every time a new video comes out. My name is Omex Jordi I will see you in the next video.